a coward. I said not bad for one night's work. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. And judging by the earmark, I'd say these are the last of Big Mike Donald's herd. Big Mike Donald had a farm? E -I -E -I That's right. He had a farm. <laughs> now that all this cash cows have disappeared, that poor set's gonna be flat broke. Perfect time for a certain upstanding landowner to step in and take all the land. <laughs> Who are you? What do you do with Uncle Slim? Put up your dukes, Mr. Fancy Britches. <laughs> it's me. Hello. This here is the disguise I use to sneak into all them auctions and buy all the land. You brainless, monotone monkeys. Shoot, you gotta be the richest land baron in the West. Yes, but the part that really warms my heart is watching those homesteaders suffer. Back in the day, I worked the highfalutinous ranches you ever seen. But those stuck-up ranch bosses couldn't appreciate my talents. Maybe they just didn't like your singing. My singing? <laughs> Songbirds, sing. Saloon gals, sing. Little bitty snot-nosed children, sing. I yodel, and yodeling is an art. Well, maybe they just didn't like your yodeling. <laughs> It's one of the funniest, cornball, goofy, silly sounds in the whole West. Patch of heaven. Huh. Uh, Gil. Uh -huh. Am I correct in assuming that each and every time we brought a herd back to this secret lair, you managed to sit in the exact same spot, blocking that choice piece of property from my view? This is my comfy place. Where? Right. It's called Patch of Heaven, Uncle Slim. Goes on auction Thursday morning. Perfect. Pencil it in. Thursday morning. Right after we sell off this herd. But it's just a little old dirt farm. Ah, uh, what's the difference when you're talking revenge?